And look at this, all the ice cream is gone. All That whole row right there was Icy Pops. All right, so now for the soda machine. You wanna open it up, Gilbert? Look at that, the first soda machine. Check it out, we've got a brand new vehicle. Yo, what's up everyone? Welcome back to a brand new video. Hope everyone's having a wonderful day today. Today we got a brand new fire video for you guys. Uh, we're gonna be going back to our newest location that we got a couple weeks ago. If you guys haven't seen that video, we got a Motel 6 where we put two vending machines, a soda machine, and a snack machine. And ever since we got that location, you guys have been dying for us to go back, fill up the machines, collect the money, and see how that location did. Now look, I'm not gonna say if that location was good or bad, but I will say that we actually had to go back three days after we put the machines in there just to put more stuff. And sadly, we actually took all the money out just because the owner wanted to see how much money was in the machines and how they were doing. So all the money that's in the machines right now is for the last four days. But anyways, before we go and fill up the machines, of course, uh, let's go to Sam's, let's buy all the ice cream, all the food, and then we'll go fill up that machine. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If y'all do, drop a like, subscribe if you haven't already, and let's go buy some food and restock some vending machines. Let's go. All right, guys. Um, Edgar's here. Let's go see what's up. <laughs> Yo, what's up? What's, what's up, up? You guys? What's Back up? Again at it. I was gonna say, what's up, Edgar? How's it going? Uh, damn, dude. <laughs> hey, I do like that. Y'all calling me Edgar out there. I mean, I'm not Edgar, you know. Hey, you kind of do. Look, I'm gonna put a picture of Edgar nah. right next to you. <laughs> no, don't, don't do it. You gotta stop it. All right, guys. So we kind of just want to uh, redo that for the intro. We actually have all this stuff in the truck already. We got the box of chips back there. My girlfriend is back there, actually. So right now we're heading to Walmart first. Or you want to go to Sam's? Yeah. So right now um, we're going to Sam's first to buy some of the ice cream, some of the other snacks, and then to Walmart to buy the rest of the ice cream. And we do have some stuff in the back of the truck. You want to show them? We have a mess in there too. Yeah, so like I said, we actually have an ice cream machine um, at the motel, which we actually put like frozen food. We, you guys haven't seen it unless you follow me on Instagram, which if you don't follow me, go follow me right now. But yeah, we put burritos, we put hot pockets, we put all the good stuff and literally like two items of the food sold. Just two? Yeah. But you told me that the, it was doing good. I mean, how, how, how is that possible? So yeah, none of the food sold in the ice cream machine. Um, so I think I might take out one row and just fill it back up with the ice cream instead. Because all the ice cream actually sold out. And just going through the parking lot like it's nothing, huh? Yeah. Hey, remember last time um, that uh, I, I, was, I was here? Uh, so, like, what happened was there was a little technical support between my vision and my truck. I accidentally took the, the car's bumper one of my videos. <laughs> you gotta tell him that? Yeah, go ahead and tell him that. <laughs> so, if the person's watching this video and I hit your bumper, just. Look at that. You guys see the tires? And yeah, I mean, we left a note and everything, so. No, we didn't. <laughs> no, we didn't. All right guys, so here we are at Sam's. Uh, we're gonna go around, we're gonna get all the ice cream. Uh, we're getting the rest of the ice cream at Walmart, so we just gotta get the snacks from here. Uh, <laughs> hey, what do you do? I mean, yeah, we need some Sour Patch, so thanks. Hold on, hold on, hold on. You, sold, you, you told me the icy sold out on the first day? You yeah, yes. There? The icy sold out in, in the first day, and we had like 30 inside of the machine. Yes, that's crazy. We're gonna get these. So we got the hot, we got the dynamites and we got the hot Doritos and the hot puffs. Um, but if you, but if you, if you put it into consideration, dude, that's like, I'm sorry, but that's like a country, country like a country town. So I mean, more though, like, you got to get the American brands, which is hot Cheetos. All right, so now for the candy, we need a lot of candy actually, right? Yeah. What else do we need? We need gummies, sour patch. That's all for the candy though. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I told him we need a lot. We got the chocolate donuts. Uh, let's see if they have them. They have. I see the powder ones. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Of course, you gotta get the ones in the back. Ooh, the ones at the very back. Look at this. You better not be on your phone on the job. Hear me? You're always on your phone.
So I tried selling these in the machine at the motel and I think in the last like two weeks I've only sold one. I actually had high hopes just because I really thought you know people were gonna get hungry and they were gonna sell out but nope. I thought the hot pockets would sell out. Yeah, the hot pockets a, a lot too. Of and these too, because I mean, it is a hotel, so. It's food, right? Yeah. But nah. and All right, guys, so now for the ice cream. There's only two things that Sam sells that we can actually sell it just because the rest of the items don't have like the actual packaging to show what it is. So the only thing we can get is ices and what else? Um, it's over here. And the fat boys, only those two things. So three ices and one of those. I think like around $220. $230? $20. $20? That's a lot. How much do you think, baby? I'm gonna say, how much are the ICs? Like 15 bucks? Nah, 10 nah, bucks? you have to 30, guess. 60. I'm gonna say like 200 at the most. <laughs> Products like this get me so annoyed. They put the barcode at the bottom. Now I gotta take the whole thing apart, take it out. Oh, it's at the top. <laughs> I thought it was at the bottom, but still, <laughs> put it on the side. Uh, how stupid do you? 176 bucks plus tax, but it'd be 200. Watch. And there we go. We got the receipt. Now let's go to Walmart. All right, guys. So since we are gonna be buying ice cream to uh, fill up the machines, we brought a big cooler. That way it doesn't melt. We don't have no ice in there though, so hopefully that's good enough. So all right, get to work. Yep. Free labor. You can't beat that. <laughs> But anyways, for the ice cream, it's kind of hard to pick what ice cream to get. But we do have a bunch of options, so you guys can see there's a lot, a lot of ice cream. What are you, Gilbert, what are you doing? I think it's all these. Oh, that one does have, you can see, look, you can see what it is. All right, guys, so this is the ice cream that we put in the, in the machine last time. So we put Snickers ice cream, which did really, really good. We put Twix ice cream. Look, there you go, the package. Oh, oh yeah. that looks really nice. Yeah. That, that looks really yeah. nice. So, I mean, you guys, you guys saw. I didn't open it. If you guys want to hate, hate on him. <laughs> I'm trying to help him out. Come on, dude. We do that behind the scenes, okay? All right. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> <I'm just playing. laughs> and also, we didn't get these last time, but I feel like they're gonna do good. So we're gonna be getting the ice cream sandwiches. All right. So now to pay me for all the ice cream. <laughs> all right. A total of thirty-five bucks. So the grand total, 35 bucks for all the ice cream plus, how much was it at Sam's? Like two, 230? 172. So in total, 200 bucks. So hopefully we collect a lot more than 200 bucks from the machines, which, quick spoiler, we will. You guys will see. Yo la ven, me interesa. Me interesa mucho. Tengo, ahorita tengo dinero en mano. Lo miro en la mitad, le doy los 5,800, ¿cómo ve? If you guys ever need somebody to negotiate your deals for you, hit up Gilbert because like, I'm not going to say too much, I'm going to save it for the end of the video, but we're looking at a new vehicle to buy just because... We had a Dodge in mind, we went to go look at it. It was falling apart. Yeah. It was bad. And, and the, the dealership, the, 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 you know, the... That you, um, you had... Yeah, so like I was saying, you know, we're looking at a vehicle to buy and at first the guy wanted like seven thousand dollars And he, you got it down to like what 55 56? Uh, 5800. Yeah, so after we go and fill up the machines and collect the money We're gonna go check out the van and who knows we might walk out today with a brand new vending machine vehicle All right guys, and we are finally here at the new location at the Motel 6, and I'm, like I said, I'm pretty excited to go in. I'm not sure how many, oh wait, I think somebody's using the machines actually. Go more forward, you're like right in front of the door. Yeah, it's good up a little bit more. I say we load up the ice cream first, I mean we. Yeah, we gotta do the ice cream first, um, but the thing that sucks is somebody forgot the dolly. Who are you blaming it on? Me. Come on baby, you got this. 
Oh, Let me see those muscles. Gilbert, you gotta use that elbow grease and put everything inside. You said elbow grease? Elbow yeah. Grease. <laughs> elbow strength. Oh wait, this is basically a dolly. Hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. It's gonna fall out. Nobody ever listens to me. Yeah. All right guys, so um, quick tip, every single time I go to my locations, I bring this just because inside I have like the, uh, the cleaner, I have the keys, change, and everything just in case I have to like switch something out. So okay. finally we're prepared. <laughs> All right, here we go, we got the keys. Number one customer right here. Wait, what'd you say, you gonna get it for free? Yeah. Mm, nope. <laughs> All right, guys. So before we actually fill up the machine, so this is the ice cream machine that I was talking about, and look at that. You see how empty it is? Look at this. Like we came what three days ago? Yeah, four days? It was, it was like four days ago. And look at this. All the ice cream is gone. All that whole row right there was icy pops. So good thing we we bought three boxes. Down there we had the Fat Boys. Um, a few of the twigs are empty, and like I said, none of the food sold for some reason. Oh wait, look at that. One of them like fell out or something. You see that? Yeah. It's like missing from the coil. So, was it worth two bucks? No. Nah. I'm about to get my two bucks back. <laughs> huh? I'm about to get them back. Yeah, two bucks? Uh -huh. <laughs> nope. All right, but anyways, uh, we have all the ice cream there. So let's put everything in the machine and let's get it filled up. So at first I was actually nervous that they were not going to fit just because it's kind of a weird shape but look at this, they actually fit perfect. All right, so we finally got all the ICs in the machine and look at this, all the way full. Looks so nice, right? Clean. Yo, look at this, there's so many. All right, so you guys know we bought the m and ice cream sandwich, which they look pretty good. Uh, but the thing is that these are pretty big, so they're not gonna fit down there. I didn't angle, it fits. Here, let me actually close the door. That way we can see if you can tell. I mean, it's kind of hard to see, but uh, we'll see. I'm just gonna have to get like bigger coils to switch those out. All right guys, so I'm actually debating if I should put the Icy Pops for $1.50, which is a lot, but whenever we had them for $1.25, they sold out in a day. Comment down below if you guys would pay $1.50 and next time I'll maybe switch them out. All right guys, but anyways, now that we have the ice cream machine all the way filled up, uh, we gotta fill up these two. So for this one, um, we have one, two, three, four, almost, yeah, four empty slots. Almost five. Yeah, almost five with that one. But there's some stuff that are pretty low, like the, the monster's low, there's only one Coke left. But yeah, anyways, uh, we have all the drinks and the cooler and the crate and everything, so let's open up the machine and then we'll get it filled up. Oh, it's actually already open. All right guys, so here we go. The last drink in the machine. Something you guys have to remember, very important, is on these machines, you wanna put the drinks facing forward because a lot of people that fill up the machines, they don't care. And they just put the drinks like all over the place, like this one, see, it's backwards. Baby, let me tell you something. What? It doesn't matter if you do it like that. You know why? Why? Because every time it comes out, it just twirls at the end of the day. So it doesn't matter. My whole life is a lie. <laughs> All right guys, so the snack machine did pretty good. Also, you guys can see the donuts are almost sold out. The cupcakes are almost gone. The cinnamon rolls are kind of low. 
if you guys have never seen a vending machine all the way filled up there you guys go look at this like it looks it's good yeah pull the lever down and then the whole tray out yeah so we're gonna take out one row of crackers and just put it together with the other one All right guys, right now we're pretty much done with all the machines. Uh, we're basically just writing down the inventory so we know exactly what sells. So for Coke, let's see, we have uh, put four for the first one. Second one, another four. The hardest part is taking the inventory on soda machines because look at all the drinks. <laughs> we have to go through every single row and count every single one. Dang, Diet Coke did not sell. Look at this, people are not on a diet here. Shh, <laughs> <laughs> they're gonna hear you. <laughs> And look at that so again for four days this one doesn't take five so it's all once but yeah not bad that's what some of the machines make in a week yeah that's what some machines make like even in two weeks and there's the coins real quick not a lot but we do have some coins all right so now for the soda machine you want to open it up yeah, Gilbert yeah, yeah, yeah. Don't take it out, just show it. Oh, look at that. Oh, we got a five. Oh, so I forgot this one takes fives. Wait, does it show in the front that it takes fives? No, it's oh, it says $1 bills only. Yeah. So again, I'm not gonna take it with me, but I am gonna take it out just to put it down there so it doesn't get stuck. So. I think I see another five. Look at that, the first soda machine. And then I just put it down here. All right, guys, so quick little lunch break. We got some Subway. Uh, you got a footlong? You like footlongs, huh? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you like footlongs? I got a six inch. Oh, you can't handle the 12 inch? You can handle it. Oh, look at this. I'm sorry if I make you guys hungry, but I'm not gonna lie, mine's pretty basic. I literally just got chicken, oh. lettuce, and ranch. Yeah. I got like everything. All right, guys, so like I said at the beginning of the video, uh, we were supposed to come and check out a van that I was supposed to buy since we don't have a vehicle right now. And we got some good news. We actually got it. The only thing we have left is just this. Just the wrap. Just the wrap. For the money. But look at this. Check it out. We've got a brand new vehicle. You can see like the, the old letters from the other business they had. So we went from 7,500 to what? Uh, 5,700. 700, almost two whole thousand dollars uh, lower. But yeah, this is it. It's not a 2019 Dodge Ram, but hey. We just gotta wrap it, put the logo, everything. All right, to make it official, the first ever product in the van. Here we go. And there it is, it's official. We need some straps though, so it doesn't go flying everywhere. All right, there we go. We got all the product that we took out of Gilbert's truck um, into the van. Now, let me close it. All right, guys, so that's pretty much it for the video. I hope everyone did enjoy. Before we end the video, there's something I want to show you guys. So we actually got some... Oh, it's actually a mess, uh, so I'm sorry for that. <laughs> so I finally got a whole bunch of packages uh, that we're going to be putting into the motel location, into the snack machine. And real quick, I want to show you guys what we're going to be putting just because it's like really weird stuff. So for the first item, we got a bunch of shaving kits. Uh, it comes with a razor and shaving cream. We're going to be selling it for like two bucks maybe. Two bucks? Yeah. And item number two, we got a bunch of deodorant for you musty people out there. So now you have no excuse to not wear any. <laughs> Shut up. <laughs> We also got a whole bunch of laundry soap boxes. Uh, for some reason, the hotel doesn't give people soap. So we got a whole bunch to put into the machines. I'm not sure how much I'm gonna sell it for, but we got a bunch of soap. All right, now for the last item. This is a weird one for uh, some people, but we got a bunch of, um, you wanna say it, baby? I mean. Don't be shy, baby. <laughs> you wanna say it? We got these. Uh, if you don't know what that is, you're probably too young or maybe under 11. Or not a girl. Is that the age? <laughs> oh yeah, or not a girl. <laughs> but yeah, once we go back to that location, we're gonna be putting all of this stuff in the machines. Uh, so real quick, 
Comment down below right now if you guys think any of these items are gonna sell in a hotel. You know, we got deodorant, we got soap. But anyways, I'll see you guys in the next video and peace out.